Here is a very useful library in React if you want to have state that is synced with the URL. The library is called Nux and it's essentially a type safe state manager based on the URL. It works pretty much just like your standard use state, with the only difference is that it syncs all of the values with the URL. So as you can see over here, we're using the use query state hook, which has the same signature as use state. It returns to us first the value and then the updater function to update that value. The only difference here is that because we are working with the URL, we have to also specify the name of the parameter inside of the URL. And then optionally, if your value is not a string because values in the URL are strings, you have to provide a parser and you can optionally also provide a default value. Everything else is pretty much the same. You can use the value in your component just like with a normal value and then you can update it as a result of a button click or something else just like your normal state value. And as you can see here, we have the count. It is currently set as zero in the URL. There's nothing there. There's no parameter. As soon as I press increment, we get the count updated to one. And we also get our count parameter inside of the URL. I can press increment again and we get an expected result. If I refresh the page, we're automatically going to get a count of two because again, the value is stored in the URL. So there you go. That's a neat little library to work with the URL in your React applications.